Good afternoon, Keller Williams, and welcome to Day 56 of the Command 66-Day Challenge. We've been talking a lot about the neighborhood snapshot pages, and I have one here loaded on the screen. Uh, this is one that I actually created for my test account for myself uh, with my personal neighborhood in it. And I wanted to make sure to draw your attention in today's challenge to the fact that there are actually three submenu items up here. So it automatically is going to load on the home screen and this is the page that we have had for a while. And I wanted to show you that you now have a search page. So super important to point this out to your clients. Obviously it's going to originally bring up homes in the area that you have already defined as their neighborhood. And you've got the map on the left and all of the properties on the right. You do have the ability to change that from the split view to the list view if you prefer that or if you just want the map view, you have that opportunity as well. And then if we go back to the split view, you can see that your clients can also draw. So let's say they're like, well, you know what? Um, I don't wanna be in Village Green anymore. I really would like to be, let's see, maybe um, a little bit further south. I think this is all of Firethorn. So if I click and hold down, I can draw around the area that I'm interested in searching for homes and it'll make this kind of weird looking shape. And then all of a sudden now I'm looking at homes in this area. So on the right hand side you can see it's going to pull up those listings and I can go through just as I was before, click on the actual listings, they're going to pull up. I can go to the go see it button from yesterday. Um, but a, a great opportunity, those of you that have used uh, Redfin before are going to kind of uh, recognize this layout, if you will, because it is very similar and we know that clients enjoy it. And so obviously um, we were, as Josh said, uh, Josh a team said, inspired by their layout and chose to make one very sim similar. So uh, that's today's challenge. Make sure that when you're sending out this neighborhood snapshot page that you're alerting your clients to the fact they can, they can choose the search tab. They can even filter over here as well. So if they're looking for a specific home uh, with the number of bedrooms, bathrooms, price range, size and square feet, et cetera, they can do that as well. So a very powerful search page available in your client's neighborhood snapshot. However, if you don't draw their attention to it, my uh, fear is that they're just gonna see the home screen and think that this is all there is to this snapshot and the search function is extremely powerful and um, you know very intuitive as well for your clients. So today's challenge, again, continue, continue, continue. We should have a neighborhood snapshot page for every client in your database. Again, we're going back from many to one to a one-to-one -one relationship to ensure that we are touching as many clients as possible and earning the right to work with them and um, have their business. So that's it, guys. That's today's 66-day challenge. As always, I hope you're having a fantastic week, and I will look forward to speaking with you tomorrow.